hey welcome back to my channel my name is ebony and i talk about locks lifestyle home you name it if you are new here welcome go ahead and hit that subscribe button to feel right at home okay so let's get right into it today i want to talk to you guys about hair and ozzy excuse me okay let me pet my dog i don't know it's like as i'm talking to the camera he thinks that i'm maybe talking to him to come over and say hello i don't know so oh, hold on. Say hi, Ozzy. Say hi to the camera. He not feeling it, y'all. Okay, so so I want to talk about hair today. I have had this style that is basically the MVP of my entire life journey. Okay, it is the MVP. It has carried me through. Okay, from the very beginning till now. Um, and I made a video about how I um do this style. And I made it like it's like my second video or something like that. But now that my hair is so much thicker, I've gotten questions like, how in the world are you fitting your hair in this freaking claw clip? How can I do a claw clip as a locked person? So I got you. I got you, girl. Um, Let's get right into it. Okay, first things. Okay, first things first, let's get into the materials that you will need. Okay, you need a freaking claw clip. So this is what I started out with in my the beginning of my uh, journey. It's very small. You see, um, I'll put it like a side by side maybe. And um, okay, so now I have something like kind of like this size. Um, when I first bought this, my hair kind of was too small for it still, but now it fits perfectly. Um, and I think I'll be able to keep this size for a while, honestly. Um, so yeah, get yourself a claw clip. I will put links in the bottom of how of where I got these, um, big and small. So just look down in the description box for uh, that if you need it. Um, and then we need bobby pins. Okay, we need bobby pins. My hair is still pretty short and not everything fits. So yeah, you're going to need that. And then you need a trusty um, hair tie. These are the ones that are seamless on, um, on, um, I got them at CVS. I don't even know what sentence I was trying to say just a second ago, but I'll put a link to, um, these as well in the description box, but I just got them at my local CVS. I'll find them online though. Okay. And then, um, edge control. If you like, if you like to slick down your edges, but you know, I do, um, go ahead and grab that too. And then we can get right into it so now that we have all of our materials it's time to do it so the first things first is that the reason why you need this rubber band is that if i were to just grab my hair up and put it in the claw clip it wouldn't work like it just don't it don't work for me okay i have to first put my hair in a ponytail and this is the magic trick y'all okay y'all it's not working out for you because you're not putting it in the ponytail i'm telling you okay my hair is um i just washed it yesterday and i did like a bit of a braid out because i actually haven't had a retwist i've been i've been putting a lot of time in between my retwists like every other month almost um and i'm gonna get retwist next week but in the meantime i kind of do like a little braid out situation to like help my um roots stay down and still give me some texture i really like the texture and if you want to figure out how to do a braid out i have a video on that so go ahead and click that um but okay let's get into it so you need the hair tie first and i'm gonna turn around really quickly let me make sure you guys can still see me okay so you're going to take your hair and you're gonna try to fit as much as you can from the top into a ponytail and I would say that the placement of this ponytail is like the middle part of your head, but it really does not have to be perfect. Okay, so you're just taking the top, remember? You really don't need to worry about the bottom in this ponytail. And it should look something like this, okay? It's looking crazy, but it's gonna look cute, okay? So you're gonna do that, and then you take your claw clip, and this is where the magic happens. You're basically faking it. You take the bottom and you pull it towards the top, okay? And now that you have all your hair together, you get to put the claw clip on, okay? Damn. 
Now look. You can't even tell. You can't tell that a ribbon is there, okay? Now you got your hair in the claw clip, okay? And no struggle, no hassle. Done! Done! Okay? So this is where the um the bobby pins come in. Sometimes, you know, some of your hair might fall out. Sometimes you're like, eh, I don't maybe like how I did my rubber band at the top. Maybe I'll just take these pieces out and pin them. You know, you can kind of get creative. For me, I'm going to first fix this by just putting these pieces down here a little bit. Same on this side. Just want... There we go. Yep, you can make little changes here and there if you want your hair in the front out go ahead and do that i y'all saw in my lock of uh, styles video i'm not a fan of this for me i don't know why it just does not it's not my thing um so i always pin it back i i think i just like how my hair looks pinned back more um and then i'm looking at a mirror and then i pin this Oh my gosh, did y'all hear that? That was my stomach growling. I'm very hungry. Um, but at the same time, I don't feel like stopping this video and eating something really quickly. So I'm gonna just finish it. And then give me some fried rice or something. Okay, so now look. Look, we looking good, okay? Now it's just time to do your edges if you want to. Um, and my edges are kind of still intact from me going out last night, but let's just do some finishing touches. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait till I get my eyebrows done. Okay. Bam. Okay, I have this weird piece. What happened there? Did I, am I suffering breakage or what? Let me figure this out. Let me just twist this back up here. I guess it kind of just came out. Y'all know how the front is for me. It just acts like it does not want to be locked at all, which I find so weird. Like I never noticed that my hair was different textures up at the top and everywhere else until this lock process because that area just really has a hard time okay and would you look at that we got a clock clipping y'all let's look at it from all angles and then what i usually do i usually like to keep one out i don't know i just like it there um but do what you want with it girl okay and that is it hope you like it and hope you try it please let me know in the comments if you give this a try i'm telling you the ponytail is the missing piece in order to be able to do this um if you have shorter hair or your hair is like mine but yeah enjoy the rest of your day bye